Hey guys, in this video, I am going to show you the three multitasking gestures available on Apple's iPad. Apple has included multitasking gestures in the iPad since its inception in 2010. Multitasking gestures come in handy very often and you find it difficult when you use someone else's tablet. To enable the multitasking gestures, open the settings app, tap on general, scroll down to enable multitasking gestures and then you are done. Uh, the three multitasking gestures are as given here. Use four or five fingers to pinch the home screen. Swipe up to multitasking. Swipe left or right between apps. So let's go through the three multitasking gestures in detail. The first one. Swipe up with four or five fingers to reveal the multitasking pane at any screen. So simply swipe up with four or five fingers to reveal the multitasking pane. So here I have the multitasking pane. The only app that is open is the settings app. And to close the app, all I have to do is this. So this is the first multitasking gesture, which is swipe up with four fingers, four or five fingers to enable the to preview the multitasking pane. Next, uh, the next app requires a certain few apps to be open. So let us just open and close certain apps. Okay, uh, so the second multitasking gesture is swipe from sides with four or five fingers to switch between open apps. In any app, if you swipe from the side of the screen with four or five fingers, it moves on to the next app that was open. The app that the iPad switches to depends on the apps that you had opened previously. So let us open uh, videos. And now I'm swiping from my right this way, so it goes to the previous app that was open, which is Photo Booth, then Game Center, then maps and then clock so this is the second multitasking gesture which requires you to swipe with four or five fingers uh, to switch between apps that are already open so let us review the last two multitasking gestures that we learned now the first one is swipe up with four or five fingers to reveal the multitasking pane uh, so here's the multitasking pane now let's just open any app the second one was to swipe with four or five fingers from the left to right to move between apps that are open the third multitasking gen gesture is pinch with four or five fingers when in any app to go back to the home screen. Save your home button. This multitasking gesture eliminates the need to press the home button to quit an app. When any app is open to close it, just pinch the screen with four or five fingers and the iPad returns to ho the home screen. Uh, so let's just see this. With five fingers, just pinch. And then the app returns to the home screen. It feels a little bit magical at first, but you'll get used to it. Uh, this is extremely convenient rather than pressing the home button which is obviously more difficult. So any app, whatever app you are in, just uh, pinch with 4 or 5 fingers to close the app. This makes it a whole lot easier to use your iPad and increases its functionality. And you may think what am I going to do saving the point one seconds here. But think about it. You open and close apps thousands of times each day. So each you will save a lot of time with these multitasking gestures. Thank you for watching this uh, video. If you like it, please subscribe to my channel and also likes for the video will be appreciated. Do follow me on my social networks and also visit my blog, TikTok. Thank you.